Uh, the eating of meat, there is a, a, for, a, for a monastic, I start off for, for the monastic, what we can do as monastics. And the only kind of meat that we can't eat as monastics is meat of animals that has been specifically killed for us. If we think that some, an animal may have been killed for us, uh, if we think or we know it has been killed for us, uh, then we can't eat that meat. And the point, of course, with that is basically that we're not allowed to, we shouldn't encourage uh, the lay supporters to kill animals for our sake. That's basically the, the point there. Huh? But beyond that, uh, the Buddha does not actually forbid uh, the eating of meat. In fact, it is one of the interesting stories in the Vinaya is where the uh, Devadatta, who was the Buddha's cousin, huh, he goes to the Buddha and he wants to split the Sangha. He wants to take his part of the Sangha to go one way and then for the Buddha to keep the, everybody else. Now one of the criteria that the Buddha laid down for splitting the Sangha, he said that, well, I say that we should be no meat eating in the Sangha. That was one of the things. And the Buddha actually rejected that. He said that is not, not the way that this Sangha should work. So basically, the, but there isn't any in the... Uh, I would say in the early suttas, there is nothing there that says that meat eating itself is wrong. There is, it's true, there is, if you go to uh, Mahayana Buddhism, there are you know, certain schools where people are told basically they shouldn't eat meat, but that apparently comes from something else. It's apparently a cultural thing which has been added to that, but those particular Buddhist schools. So it doesn't actually come from the Buddha himself. Now you may think that, well, how can it be that you know, we shouldn't kill animals on the one hand, and yet we are allowed to actually eat meat on the other hand? And I think the answer there is simply that uh, it is the act of killing itself, that intention that you have when you pull the trigger of that gun or you let go of that arrow as at the time of the Buddha, that act when you know that I am now killing this living being, now that is the problematic one. That is the one which is really uh, heavy karma, if you like, from a Buddhist point of view. Uh, 